All right, boys. Looks like we got ourselves a banger. Three versus one. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> no, look at him. Look at all three of them. <laughs> oh, look at him. Fight. <laughs> All right, all right. Holy shit. <laughs> Typically, when you fight three versus one, you want to target one person. No, see, this guy. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> this guy's so far out the void. He can't get past this block. This guy's like, come on. He's trying to get Look at him. He knows he's. <laughs> What's going on, boys? Welcome back to the channel. And uh, here we go again. We got three versus one dogfight wild tournament, second impact. Look at the arena. It is sold out crowd, ladies and gentlemen. I am super excited to break down this fight. If you are new to the channel, make sure you like, subscribe. Also, hit the bell to know when we go live. All right, boys. Looks like we got ourselves a, a banger. Three versus one. Uh, Okay, obviously, these gentlemen are not the same size as the other guy. Uh, typically, you know, nowhere in the world, and I'm assuming in America, is the commission ever going to allow this to happen. But over in other beautiful parts of the world, in Russia and, you know, uh, Brazil, I have no idea. I know not in America, in the 50 states, an athletic commission would ever sanction this battle. But, ladies and gentlemen, somebody did. And we're going to break it down. We have a one gentleman who looks to be bigger of the three gentlemen. And uh, all right, here we go. I was listening to see if he was going to give me a weight. Look at these guys. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> look at him, look at all three of them. <laughs> all right, here we go. Okay, <laughs> look at him. It's like Kumote. Look at this guy. Why is this guy got his shirt off? <laughs> all right, all right. Holy oh, shit. <laughs> Oi. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. So this guy made the mistake. Okay. He jumped on the hips, trying to take the bigger guy. He should have dropped down here and tried to attack the ankles. That way he can actually try to spread the base out in order to get it. But right now, he's just trying to, he's not going to be able to hold this guy down because he's way bigger than him. Okay, so that was the first mistake, allowing this guy to get up like that. All right, so the giant gets up. Eduardo gets up. All right, oh, okay, the guy gets him down. They can't hold him down. <laughs> yeah, see, that guy's still trying to get it down, which... Yeah, so this guy's pretty much useless. He's not doing it. He's just holding his hips. If this guy was bigger, then it'll be a problem, but he's pretty much useless. Typically, when you fight three versus one, you want to target one person. You target the one person that you can get him out there, execute that one. You have 2v1, execute another one, then you go 1v1, then you're good to go. That's typically what they say is you want to target one person. You can't try to target all three at the same time. You target one, the weakest one. They say take out the weakest link, then you're good to go. Let's see if the gentleman has that instinct in his mind. Okay, he's separating. He grabs that one into clinch. Yeah, see, the one in the back ain't doing nothing. He's pretty much just garbage. He's gone. Okay, now he's getting a separation. No, see, this guy. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> this fucking guy. <laughs> this guy's so far out the void. He can't get past this block. So right here, he recognized this guy can't do anything because this guy's here. He's controlling his posture. He's looking down. And this guy right here is looking this way. So I just like him. This guy's like, come on. Come on. So smart by this gentleman to put up a barrier. He puts up a barrier so this man can't cross the void. Let's see what he does next. <laughs> 
Okay, so he reversed the guy. Okay, he got taken down. And he's hiding. Oh, so he reversed the guy on the bottom. So the guy on top is trying to go for a guillotine, but he can't get it. Okay, he's covering himself. Okay, so now the guy fought. <laughs> the guy on top. <laughs> okay. He's still in it. He's still in it. Ooh, he, he's taking some good shots too, man. But see, there's that guy. He's... Ugh. See, the guy on bottom needs to go down to a leg. Here we go. See, once again... Okay, that's round one. Okay. <clears throat> he's still good in the fight. The guy who's holding his waist, he's doing absolutely nothing. Like, he needs to go down attacking a leg. All right, that's in round one. Boys, boys, we got ourselves a fight here. Oh, my goodness. This is amazing. <laughs> look, look at him. Take a deep breath. See, this guy over here, him, he just blew his wide. Holding that big, strong guy, you got to go to a leg. You never grab a bigger man by the waist, especially if he's taller. You go to the leg, and you drag one of the legs away from his post. Stress the chair out. Damn, this crowd is lit. I wonder what they're saying to him. And FYI, this is the first time I've ever seen this. I saw like a 10 second highlight and I was like, no, 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 no. I'm breaking this down. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. Round two. The fact that this made it to another round is pretty, pretty incredible. All right, here we go. <laughs> he do fight. Okay, he's trying to get <laughs> See right there? Right there. Boom. Smarter than this guy. Let me back up just real quick. Smarter than this guy. Okay, watch. They run across the distance, smother him. Smart from those guys. But this is where they make a mistake. Look at that horrible posture right there. This guy shoots for a double leg. Head is an outside. You're going to see him go down and guillotine him. When he takes one out, that's one less person he's going for. So he saw an opportunity to take an advantage of this gentleman's horrible shot. And let's see if he gets the guillotine. He's going for it. Goes for it. Oh, that's in deep. It's in deep. Oh, that guy's out. He's out. He's out. He's got one out. Okay. It was the guillotine that started it all. He's out. Okay, so one's done. Look, he's just now waking up. Look, he's waking up. Look, he got one out because he had that bad shot with the guillotine. Look, he doesn't even know what happened. <laughs> he put him out hella quick. <laughs> now, 2v1. He's like, yeah, I can do this. No, now they don't want to smother him, right? See, now... Oi! <laughs> See, and here's the problem. This guy here, instead of punching him, he needs to get on his back and perfect choke from him. He needs to get on his back and start to grapple him. Punching, you know, you can hit somebody in the head many times unless you're going to kick him. Like if it's a street fight, you can kick him when they're down like this. It's going to be a, a one-shot kill. But the guy on the back needs to get on his back and start choking him. That way he can get his hands busy. Okay, now he's starting to do it. Okay. See, now he has to respect it, but he has no hooks in. No hooks. So he goes, he's going to go right off the top. <laughs> he's got him in Uma Plata. <laughs> he's got him in Uma Plata. Oh, God. <laughs> this man's in Uma Plata and a rear naked choke. But see, no hooks. Okay, even though he has the neck, there's no hooks. 
So right now, the Eduardo has gravity on his side because this gentleman can't stay anchored to his hips. So all he has to do is keep shaking, and, and this gentleman is going to fall off the top. And wow, this guy has him a fucking umablada. All right, let's keep on going. Watch. He's going to fall off. Fall, he's going to fall off the top. Watch. And he loses the choke. Doesn't fall off the top, but he loses the choke. Now he's in Uma Plata. Okay, see now, see now the bigger uh, Eduardo can't punch because now he has to protect his neck and he's getting his, control, his posture controlled. Look, that guy is spent in the back. Absolutely spent. What? What? That's the end of the round. What are they doing? Ooh. Wow. That timekeeper is a little bit, uh, a little bit bad if you ask me. <clears throat> oh, man. So now these guys are spent. Oh, my goodness. This is absolutely hilarious. God bless the internet. I can't, I feel like that the language might be Spanish. Yeah, that's Spanish. Okay, here we go. Sorry, guys. I was trying to listen to see if it was Spanish or what, what language was it? Language is it? He said amigos. And so that's why I, I said uh, that might be Spanish. Spanish. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, here we go. Oi. Oh, he's going to try to get him. See, once again, that guy's going for the back. It's not a good thing. He's going for the guillotine. Oh, he's got it. <laughs> Look at him. He can't do that. He's going <laughs> to... <laughs> Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. <laughs> Look at him. He knows he's fucked. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, man. Good leg kick. Okay. <laughs> oh, bad mistake. <laughs> oh. He overshot that. He overshot that right hand. There is nothing he do. He's a smaller dude. He gets it back. Hooked her in. Cross the edge game. Yeah, it's game. 3v1. Oh, my goodness. Look at that crowd. Wow. Woo. So, the, the biggest thing coming from, like, like breaking this down, it, this is more purely entertainment. Absolutely amazing heart of all four of the gentlemen, especially the one who's by himself, Eduardo. The biggest thing you can take from this is that you have to target one. Each time these guys made a mistake, which was in the grappling department, they would shoot him with bad posture. Eduardo was able to break the, uh, break the posture with his chest, get the guillotine, and get one out. And he did a good job of putting one of them in front of the other one so the one behind him uh, across the void couldn't even actually get a shot off. And then once he got out the second person, it was pretty much all downhill from there. There was nothing to do, especially when the guy overshot his right hand. But hey, boys, this is why I love this, breaking out content that you guys send to me. God bless you guys. Thank you guys once again for making this channel amazing. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe. Also, hit the bell to know your life. GG's. We out, boys.